and he might have to pay dearly for it tonight. Do you think it's a one and done deal if that is the case, Scott? Well, first of all, he should get crushed, and if Ted Cruz doesn't crush him, then it's a win for Trump. Uh, after all the negativity, the millions of dollars that have been spin. spent that against him. Well, it's too shit. He's up by 30 points, and is it 20 or 30? Okay, very good. Um, the point is. Who are you talking to? <laughs> Neil. You're imaginary friend, Dark. Neil. That's fine. That's Belinda. Oh. Okay. <laughs> very close to me. She's so thin, she's almost invisible. Okay. I love her thigh gap. Uh, but the point is, if Donald Trump wins here tonight, that's why this is a make or break state. Hey, Polls are good just to see five you. minutes away. Uh, from closing here, we could have an idea as to whether Liz Clayman went out on a limb, is right, and Donald Trump wins, or <laughs> she is horribly, horribly wrong. Here we come. Senator Ted Cruz pulling off a win on the Republican side. God bless the great state of Wisconsin. Wait a Lou? second. We're bearing the lead here. L Lou and what I both big, agree. What did Big Red uh, predict? Big Red? Yes. <laughs> I, I would like to say, <laughs> often wrong, never in doubt. <laughs> Fox projects that Bernie Sanders will beat Hillary Clinton in the Wisconsin Democratic primary. Thank you all very much. 18 to 44 year old Sanders coming away with a huge win there, winning 73%. Do the kids know what the Cultural Revolution is? Do they know about the Gulag? No, I mean, do they, they, know? They, they don't, don't know. And that's why I what think about the first the, the, was. The they don't know Civil these War. kinds yeah. of things. Yeah. Well, they don't know that either. And do, have they read Das Kapital? I don't know. But They've never know. even seen Rocky IV. <laughs> I had a great one. And that's that is a great one, Lou. You're absolutely right. By the way, Kevin, you thank you for chasing away the young demo. We appreciate that. He's digging. He's he's egging on here, well, and it just feels and he has like to be, he is involved. He has to be very subtle, or he gets accused of being sexist, which is so ridiculous. But I, you know, Charlie made an interesting point earlier. That's such a chick comment. <laughs> that's Joe, funny. Lady Linda Rothschild. I love that, dude. Lady Linda. The Rothschild. Um, she's royalty. It is about being really angry with the establishment. Well, she's the establishment. she's the establishment. She's the establishment. She's the establishment. She's the capitalist. My, I have a quick question. Lady, you're the establishment. Um, Lady Blaine <laughs> Kennedy, no. I have a very quick I'm question. I'm a rebel. I'm rogue. Right. When, when Secretary Clinton... <laughs> you're royal rogue. Uh, royal rogue. Yeah. You can't get an official take on a night until you talk to Pat Cadell, uh, famous Democratic pollster, made... Jimmy Carter, President of the United States. Would you treat the next president with any more respect than the last one you worked for? This is a famous shot of Pat Cadell with Jimmy oh, Carter. God, here you. And here's oh the famous one where Jimmy Carter wants to shake your hand. You're not even looking at it. <laughs> Which I admire in a way. You're such a big deal. He's in the Oval Office. You got him elected. And you can't even look at him when he's shaking your hand to thank you. Why? Uh, the, uh, um, obviously, this is the arrogance of you. Uh, today, I would be humble. I had this dream the other night of Donald Trump where his head was bald, but, his, but it was long hair and he was flipping it over. Just, this is the way you spend your evening? I'm telling you. I don't I know where he's going. Can I sue someone for the last time? I'm telling you, I can flip around the dial any other station. You're not getting it. I'm done. I'm done. I want to thank all of these guys. Everyone. Great. We'll see you again. All right, so we have fun with this, and I'm a little biased. I think the best and brightest in the business. Also talking to the biggest newsmakers in the business. Also, concurrently, foreign market reaction as it's happening live. Find me another business network. Find me any network that does that so consistently. That would be us. We mean business. And when we say that we've got your back when it comes to money issues, because we realize a lot more of you pay taxes than might, let's say, own stocks, we take stock of you in America every single time. We're